morning everyone and I hope you're all well. Well, I have just come downstairs to Tilly, Holly and Phoebe do my breakfast. Look at this. We've got some toast. We've got some biscuits and some apples. We've got some um, cards, haven't we? This one's for you, Mum. Oh, thank you. It says love. We've got some flowers and I think that's me. Yeah, that's you and me. Oh, I love that, Holly. That's really good, isn't it? And it says mum. Love Mom. you, Mum, doesn't it? Mom. Dear. Dear Mum. Sorry, you've got some nice lipstick on this morning. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you've got something stuck to one's it. Now then. Oh, it's okay. Mm -hmm. I'm I'm there you go, you show me that I'm one. And we've got this one, Phoebe. It's a daddy. Oh, is that daddy's? You show me it then, and we'll, just, we'll give that to daddy when he gets home from work, yeah? Yeah. It says dad. And then, oh, bless, he must have thought that. Daddy was not at work today, wasn't you? No. He's at work, isn't he? I didn't see my numbers. You did. Mom, this you didn't breakfast know. is for you. Is it? Well, thank you. We're so we got two biscuits for you. Yeah, you got my favourite biscuits. Morning. Didn't you? Right, should we get some breakfast for you guys? You can eat your Don't your onesies look cute? Should we show everybody them? Mm. You've got frozen onesies, haven't you? And Bonnie does. And Bonnie's got her Peppa Pig one. Haven't you? And Alexa's doing her own thing, saying that she's connected to somebody's iPhone. Well, there you go. Right, come on. Let's go sit down. We're going to get some breakfast. We even have hoods. Nah, you won't have this. We even have hoods. You do even have hoods. And they've even got... Whoa! They've got snowflakes on them. Right, so should we have some breakfast? Who Yay! Yay! Also, Obviously, the kids were back at school for one day on Monday, and Oscar won this for doing amazing work before Christmas. And look, it's so good. It's, it's Oscar's, isn't it? He loves it, doesn't he? No, Casper. No, it's not Casper's, it's Oscar's. He won it at school for doing fantastic work. Would you like a slice of the apple? Okay, I'll bring it round. He's got the biscuit. What do you want? Do you not want one? Okay. Hang on guys, I am coming around with the plate. Let's get some cereal down. There's not much in that one. Why? Why put cereal away and it has like little feet in the bottom? That's got nothing in there. Why has that been put back? No ideas? Let's move to this cupboard. There we go. Awesome. Does anybody want any wee bits? Yeah, yes, yeah, me, me. Yeah? Mom. Yes, that is me. I'm the best. You want these? I'm the best. Do you want some toast? Yes. I tell you what, you can have daddy's then. Because he's not here. And I'm sure... I wouldn't mind. Mummy, that's yours. Is that mine? What are you eating? My breakfast. Hello. <laughs> I'm joking. Look at little Heidi. What are you doing? It's morning. so sunny this morning. Right, come on, let's get some bowls out. So we've got one, two, three for Weeta Vix. And now she's got his toast. Anyway, we had a bit of a disaster yesterday. We went and got all of the food shop. Oh, uh, day before yesterday, the fridge was full. It was full. The freezer was full. And now it's not. It's empty because the freezer has... The freezer... We noticed the freezer was all... Well, all the frozen stuff were all melted and just all defrosted. Thought, mmm, that doesn't look good. No! So we emptied all of the freezer out and thought, oh, maybe it's just a freezer that's broken. We'll have to get somebody out to come and fix it. And then we noticed that the fridge was not cold. And it had, like I say, it was full. It was full of all of the meat, just everything. So we've had to throw the lot out. And I've just been shopping, so I'm not best pleased. But anyway, um, it's got a 10-year warranty. 
10 year warranty on the compressor, which we think it is the compressor that's gone, but it's a bit of a swizz really. It's got a, it's got a warranty on that, but you have to pay for somebody to come out and you also have to pay for it to be fixed. Yeah, and in all honesty, Noel absolutely hates that fridge freezer there. It doesn't like it at all. So we're not sure yeah. whether to just keep it. But I want my purpose too. Oh, I'll get rid of it. I don't know. <laughs> decisions, decisions. But I do like that fridge freezer for more storage. And I keep all the meat in there. And then obviously all of the cooked meats and yogurts and just everything else in that one. So I don't think I'm going to have much room for things without it. So we probably will end up getting it fixed. But it's a bit of a nightmare. Because like I say, I had to throw the lot out. The lot. So I need to go shopping again today and try and rejig that fridge so that I can fit everything in. So, yeah, a bit of a nightmare, but anyway. Never mind. Anyway, we're going to sort your breakfast out. Do you want some porridge this morning? She's like, yeah, just suck my thumb. Where's your fingers today? Where's your fingers? Oh, never mind. It's going in the wash anyway, isn't it? Uh, yes, it is. Right, little Miss Heidi, are you ready for your porridge? Are you tired? Are you a bit sleepy? Yeah. Yeah. I think that's a monster. It's a what? I feel that's a monster. No, it's not a monster. It's a rice crispy. I heard right, if you porridge. can sit down, you can feed her it. Come on. I heard the word porridge. Come on. Wait, wait, I'll tell you. Oh, have you got some porridge? Do you want to pull that back? That's no, Do you want to feed Heidi? Shut Come up. on then. Shut up. Where's the porridge? Tori. Oh, voila. You have to take two fingers out of your mouth. Do you mind? Sonny's like, yeah, come on then. Right, a little bit on it. <laughs> little bit, this could get messy. Do you want mommy to do it? Yeah, mummy do it. Right, you sit back and then I can just pop that there in it. I'll put it in it. Yeah. I'll put it in it. Go on. Oh, no, that's a bit much, darling. Mummy will just get some on there and then you can feed her it. There you go. You do that. Yeah? Yeah. Watch your fingers. Fingers out. Ooh. No, no, no. She likes it. Open Emma. mouth. Emma. Like, no, hang on, let's just open mouth. Let me get some more. Some more. Some more. Are you ready? Are you ready? Good morning. Mm. Um. Um. Good job, Bonnie. Some more, let's just push that on and then just. Like that. Very sticky. It's very sticky. <laughs> Is she being cheeky? Come on. I think Mabel wants to come in to Do you want to go and open the door? Come on. She's like, no, just have my fingers. Oh well, um, this morning's going great. We're trying to get the kids on all of their learning because obviously we're in lockdown now and the kids are not going to school. I've got Josh saying, I haven't got my planner. I said, come on, we'll log you on to your work on the laptop, which is another issue. I'll tell you about that in a second. Log you on to your um, learning because you can do it on the laptop today because Ellie and Amy have got their workbooks. And he's going, oh, I don't have the, my logging details because it's in my planner. My planner's at school and I'm not allowed to bring it home. Ellie and Amy went, yeah, you are allowed to bring that home. In fact, you do have to bring that home. He was like, oh, do I? And then Amy said, oh, it's fine. We'll go on my um, online details and then we can get onto yours through mine. So that's what we're doing at the minute. Then I've got Ellie saying, I mean, not Ellie, Tilly. We went to log on to Tilly's and she doesn't have any work on her. So I had to get in touch with Skill. I said, there's no work on Tilly's account. It shouldn't be on there now. And so she's going to get a teacher to bring me back. The other primary school where Oscar, Casper, Hallie and Phoebe go to have been brilliant. We can they are loading out Chromebooks to do their work on because theirs is quite difficult. Not at the minute. I've got a lot of 
Um, as I was saying, their school have been absolutely brilliant. They are getting loaned some Chromebooks so that they can do all of their online learning. Because theirs is quite difficult, you've got to log on to lots of different, you've got to have lots of different passwords for different things for them to get onto. So it's really hard work. So anyway, I've just phoned them, I said, when can we come pick them up? I'm going to go and pick them up shortly when Millie gets up. I'm going to leave the kids with Millie and go and quickly go and pick them up so that they can do their learning. Hallie and Phoebe have got their workbooks. In the drawers. But I feel like you, you guys, you need to wish me luck because I'm really not, I'm not a teacher. I feel like this is just not going to go well. But um, we're like everybody else, we're just going to have to just make the most of it, aren't we? Just do our best and that's all you can do, isn't it, really? I've ordered a load of stuff from Amazon as well. We've got some crafty things and we've got a biscuit. We're going to also do some baking a bit later on. I just feel really sad. I went yesterday morning to wake Hallie and Phoebe up and Phoebe said, oh, we're going to school because obviously they've been to school on the Monday. And I was just like, no, we can't go to school today because, you know, we're in lockdown and school's not on now. And bless her, she started crying. And I just kind of feel like, just really sad. Please, can you turn the tally down for me, Tilly? I just feel really sad that, you know, our children are just going to, I don't know, it's their mental health and it's our mental health. And it's, just, it's all of that, isn't it, really? And they want to be at school mixing with their friends. Do you want the dog? Do you want the dog? <laughs> it's like, no, no, I'm not feeling Just a second, I'll be back in a minute. Well, that's um, Heidi just being fed, so she's quiet. So, yeah, like I was saying, I just feel really sad for the kids at the end of the day because they're missing out on, well, their childhood, really, isn't it? Because they're not able to go to school, they're not able to mix with all of their friends. And it's just really hard for them, isn't it, at the end of the day? But we're lucky in the respect that we obviously do have a lot of children, so they won't be short of company. But it's not the same as them seeing their friends. And like I say, yesterday morning when I went to get Hallie and Phoebe up, it just really hit me that less than they are just... It's not fair on them, is it? But we have to do what we have to do at the end of the day. And hopefully, fingers crossed, come March, April time, I'll be back at school and everything will be starting to get back to normal. But for now, I feel like... So anyway, I'm just going to wait for Millie to get up and then I can go and get these Chromebooks for the boys and then hopefully it will make their online learning a little bit easier. We can't have them, like I say, for Hallie and Phoebe. It was just for Austin Casper's age group. But like I say, they've got their workbooks, so they should be fine. Heidi, what have you got? You wait till you can walk with that. This is this is actually the most annoying toy ever. Yeah, it's isn't it? Read about it Hang on. Listen to this. Lock your ears though, actually, because it isn't that loud. And then they're running around the house with that. It's annoying, isn't it? It's annoying. Look what Noel's tried to do to it. He's tried to quieten it down a bit, but it has not worked. <laughs> well, it has a little bit to be fair, but not much. What's this? Hey, what's that? And here is Ophelia. Have you been a naughty girl for mummy last night? Were you a naughty girl for mummy? Were you? She's like, yeah. Does this face look bothered? Does this face look bothered? <laughs> hey. Josh is just doing his online learning there. We've managed to get him on. Which is great. Mabel's just keeping him company. Hey. Yeah, they're just doing it upstairs. Um, they've got their workbook. So I'm just going to go and pick up the boys chrome tablets in a minute from school this oh, toy this is, is absolutely brilliant Heidi loves this toy what? <laughs> what's that <laughs> she loves it doesn't she she's not actually interested at the moment eh? yay what's that oh, what's that bye bye Pretty, are you dancing? Excuse my singing, guys. Just got back from picking the boys' chrome tablets up, and honestly, like, why do my kids throw it peel on the floor? What do you say? I know, yeah.
Yeah, orange peel on the floor. Anyway, managed to get them um, two Chromebooks. So that's that's Casper's there, and that's Oscar's. So I'm going to get them onto their learning shortly. Katie's getting a laptop from college, aren't you, Katie? Oh, you Katie nails. Yeah, they went way wrong. Wow. You could just see, I've got an air branch in the cupboard in there, with me. Yeah. Right, who's ready for some lunch? But I tell you what, shall I pick up that orange pillow? Are you going to do it? Josh. That is not Josh that's done that. No, Mummy. Did you, did you put the orange pillow all over the floor? No, Josh. That's not Josh. Uh, no, it's not. No, it's not. That is not Josh. No, it's not. Who's done this to her? Who is responsible for the orange peel on the floor? Uh, I think Archie. Yeah, he's saying it was Josh. <laughs> Honestly. Right, I'm going to get little Heidi off up to bed because she's just had her dinner and a feed. I'm ready for... Ready. I'm <laughs> going for sleep. <laughs> and then I'm going to get these boys off their switches and doing some school work. What? Off switches and doing some school work, yeah? Yeah? Oh, this is not going to be the situation, guys. I need to get more organised. It's like one o'clock. I've just been on the phone to my mum for the last. 20 minutes. Kids are all fed, but I still not even got any of them to do any homework yet. So the day is not going well. And I've got to go out shortly because I've got work things to do. So I need to get the kids on their laptops, do a bit of skill work, get this little one to bed. And get myself organised. Right, you hold the camera. And I'm going to put. Heidi Boo's into Betty. <laughs> Holly's doing the vlogging. <laughs> Heidi Boo's is half asleep. I hope you girls come up to say hi. Mum, Heidi Boo's asleep. There we go. Look at that, she's fast asleep. Flat out. Right, Bluebell. Come on, let's go down. Have you come up to see Heidi? Well, Moose just got back from town with um, Ophelia and Katie, and yep. she's got like bags of right, bunnies. Mom, I've got something. Right, come on then, Millie. What did you get? Mum is very um, OCD about her ovens. She absolutely loves her ovens. She's okay. always putting them on a two-hour wash. Oh, it's, it's elbow, elbow grease. grease set for oh, your wow. oven. Excellent, Millie. Oh, thank Clean you. Set. Oh, Millie, do loads. spoil me. Look at that. Yeah, we'll have to try that. It has yeah. a self cleaning thing on it, but we can use that after yeah. it's done it, can't we? We can. Kate I just got loads in the face with a muffin. My diet starts tomorrow. <laughs> said that last night. <laughs> the kids have finished yeah. their homeschooling for the day, so they're just watching a bit of Jurassic Park. Phoebe's over there chilling with me. Maybe we've been very quiet today. It's very chilled out, I must say. Got your two new Hi, baby. Oh, hello. Okay, you got two new. Oh, perfect, Molly. They're the pop-up ones. Because we needed Fabulous. another one of them for the bathroom upstairs, yeah. didn't we? Look at this gorgeous girl. Have you been shopping? Oh, you got two boys. Have you been shopping? Have you? Did you just get a few bits? Okay. Oh. So I did. Oh. Baby. Look at how cute a little Molly is. So oh. cute. Mom. We're just sitting um, home by and just smelling everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Smell this. You want to smell it? Oh, that's nice. What is that? Sugar, sugar plum delight, Millie. Sugar plum delight. Oh. Archie wants to smell. I smell. I smell. Oh, hi, Maple. Hello. Was that nice? Right, well, I'm just going to get tea sorted. Um, we are having tonight. Doesn't actually have a name, but we're going to call it red chicken pesto like thing. I've made it in the past and the kids quite enjoy it. Anyway, it is this. So basically, it's a jar of that red pesto, some spring onions, I've got some green beans, sponge two, tin potatoes for a bit of speed, my chicken, uh, and then we'll have it with some rice noodles. Dead simple to make, basically, 
chop your chicken up, fry it off, add that, add that, fry it for a few more minutes, add them, your orange too, coconut milk and your potatoes and then you just cook it for about 15 minutes or so until your chicken's cooked and that's it and then serve it up. Actually with this one I will chuck in um, a tin of chopped up tomatoes so they'll go in as well but that's it dead simple to do it I'll serve that with me a little thin rice what do you call it I'll serve that with my rice vermicilli vermicilli however you say it uh, anyway we went for a walk on Sunday and we never got around to editing that so I'll drop that in here then when you watch that come back and you can see our tea finished Happy New Year Happy New Year um, today we are going for a walk we would say New Year's Day walk but we're a bit delayed with that <laughs> a few days later um, we're going for a walk to Nicky Nut I think yeah. it's called it's about a 20 minute drive from our house um, and we're bringing all the dogs We've got Lola here, she loves her walks. <laughs> um, yeah, so we're going to go on a nice walk, because obviously we're back got into slings, tier four. So we've got slings, um, yeah. and been to do a big Aldi shop this morning, so that oh, took yeah. a while, didn't it? But yeah. I was glad to get that out there, and that's done. Yeah. Put all the way, and we'll find the outlets. Finally. Get some fresh air. So we have arrived at Nicky Nut. We've got Heidi in a sling okay. with Mummy. No, mm. oh, you're having some. And we've got Bonnie no. with a little hat and wellies on. <laughs> Katie, oh. turn round. Then we've got oh, look at Heidi, uh, Katie, and Ophelia. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, we had to bring the dogs. She looks very cute in that hat, doesn't she? She does. Say, so I'm thinking. We're going for a nice walk. It's absolute freezing. It is. It is cold. It's so cold, but it's nice. Through the kissing gate, you have to give them a kiss on the other side. Oscar's like, yeah, right. <laughs> Go on, Ivy. Look at Ivy's tongue sticking out. Ivy! 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 Does she ever put that tongue away, no? Yeah. yeah? This is 75 pounds. Dog walkers, beware. If you allow your dog to foul, you could be fined 75 pounds. You have to pick it up. Well, some of them have gone back because other walkers have come down the hill and said it's really a bit dangerous carrying babies because it's quite icy and slippery. So Sue and a few of them, all the babies in fact, and Millie and I can't remember who else, Katie, They've gone back because, oh, out of breath, it's a little bit icy and slippery. So just myself, some of the older ones, going to keep toes. going up. I'm just, if it gets a little bit too icy, we'll just turn around and go back ourselves. But so far, so good. Yeah, that's all changed, Dad. <laughs> I've done this for a long time. You out of breath, girls? Yeah, a bit. <laughs> I'm all right, I've got Lola and she's pulling me up the hill. Get those two all the way up there. Oh my Give goodness. us a wave. What a view, what a view. Give us a wave. What a view it is. Give I us a wave. Help. <laughs> you guys, bring us away. Okay. These little legs powering away. Go on. Oh, sat down for a rest as soon as I said that. Oh, you got something in your welly, Bob. <laughs> Can you? I can see the top, he says. Okay, Holly. And we're off. Woo. How's that for a view? Wow. Okay. Oscar, I thought you said you could see the top. Yes, Where? That's not the top. Tell you, Top's yeah. further and further Maybe up there. Said, There's the top, I think. Where? Possibly yeah. right over there where all them people are. Can you see it? Can you see the top right over there? There's Blackpool Tower. 
Is it? Yeah. Oh wow. Yeah. I don't think we'll see on the camera, but Blackfield Tower is all the way over there. Oh yeah. Phoebe's loving it. Look at her, she's off. Dad, we're Well, we're at the top. It's got really windy. Is everybody here? I'm going to fall off. The wind's pushing me. Right, show her a picture. You take a picture of us all at the top. Right, tea's ready. The hungry hippos are starting to arrive. Yeah. Then there's a few in there. Uh, Phoebe, get down. So there's the big pan of gruel. I think we need a bigger pan, kids, do you? Yeah. And then we've got the noodles in there. Until it's tea time, it's getting noisier. Anyway, which looks better? Noodles on the bottom or noodles on the top? Both look good. Well, guys, that's it for today's vlog. Hope you've enjoyed watching it. Uh, tea went down really well. Uh, all the kids enjoyed it after all, so that was good. Um, homeschooling, I think, went a bit better today, according to Sue. Um, Oscar and Casper now have their own tablets, which they've picked up from school. Well, Sue's picked up for them. So they've, each child at the school has their own, so they've, they've been... Uh, Sue's got them, and obviously they can log into their schoolwork a lot easier. Uh, Josh and Max, they've been doing some. Um, who else have we got? Tilly, she's finally got managed to log in and get sorted. Um, Katie and James, they're waiting on their tablet, iPad thing, whatever you call them. Oh, it's Ellie, that is. Yeah? It's me and Ellie. Oh, is it you and Ellie? Yeah. All right. Nothing to do with Katie. Ellie and James, we got them like an iPad tablet thing, whatever you call them, I don't know what they're called, uh, for Christmas, but they haven't arrived yet, so we're still waiting for them. So as soon as they, uh, as soon as they get here, they'll be able to log in onto their coursework and get cracking. Um, they can use my one can use my laptop, but then you know, I, James can, but Ellie can't. So we're a bit stuck at the minute. Uh, although we are better prepared than we were for the first lockdown, we seem to have a few more tablet and things that they can all access the schoolwork on. Kids really enjoyed the walk that we went on on Sunday. The, uh, they're all pestering to go back again, but um, it's just it's just too icy at the minute. It was too. We want to go back when it's not as icy, so the old the, the younger ones can get to the top because it's quite an easy walk. It's just just too dangerous. But there were ice everywhere, and we were we were all right. But there was people falling over, up and going up and coming back down. So anyway, we'll go another day when it's not quite as icy. But it's just, it's frosty again outside already. Every single morning this week I've had to defrost the car or I sit in it and have the engine running whilst I'm waiting for Chloe. So, really cold at the moment, isn't it? Right, folks, I'm going to get going and get to bed because it is now nearly 11 o'clock and I've got to get up early for work. Hey, guys, see you again soon.